Welcome to Average Joe's Gym's Home Projects, where we do projects and maintenance at home that even an average Joe can accomplish. In today's episode, we are going to build these shaved covers for my above ground sprinkler valves. The west side of my house gets extremely hot in the afternoon, and my valves and pipes are starting to show sun damage. I decided to build two separate covers since my valves are not right next to each other. Let's do it. So I decided to use scrap wood I had left over from my wood fence that blew down last winter. Just some reclaimed slats and a 2x4 should do the trick. I had to pull a few remaining nails to protect my saw blades. As usual, I'll put links in the description for any tools I use. I decided to rip the 2x4 down the middle to use for the framing. You can see in the bottom left, my dog Max loves to hang out with me when I do projects but he isn't the biggest fan of power tools. He'll be back later once all the noise dies down. After measuring to confirm, I should have enough framing material for both covers using just that one 2x4. I decided I wanted the top part of the cover to have an angle to it. So on the top of the frame, I made a cut with a slight angle using my miter saw. Welcome back, Max. He must have decided it's safe to return with no power tools running. Poor guy doesn't realize I'm only about halfway done. I think it's important to mention that I use self-tapping wood screws or cabinet screws for any build that I do. They sort of drill their own hole as they are driven into wood. This way it's less likely your wood will crack and you won't have to pre-drill, saving you a lot of time. 
As you can see, I'm basically building a wood paneled wall for the front of the shade cover. This will block the sun as it sets over my neighbor's house, and as my friend Tim, YouTube's A Modern Maker said, will give privacy to the black widow spiders that will one day inhabit my vows. Now it's time to build the roof of the cover. What poor Max doesn't realize is that my circular saw is going to get some work here in a few minutes. So here's the first cover done. It just leans against the house, but it's going to do a great job of shading my sprinkler valves from the afternoon sun. Now it's time to start the second cover for my remaining four valves. I used what was left of the slats that I cut when I made the first cover. I know I always say that something always goes wrong in any home project, but in this case, I have just the right length of slats left to finish the job on the second cover. Because this cover is a bit smaller, I decided to rip this final board to make it look a little more pleasing to the eye. It had quite a bit of overhang, and I didn't like the way it looked. So here it is, two shade covers to protect my above ground sprinkler valves and pipes. If you enjoyed this project, please check out our other projects on Average Joe's Gym's Home Projects. And please like and subscribe for future projects.